was really nice to finally hear what my best friend truly thinks and feels and you know and I know you feel the same way yeah okay well let's go take over the world okay it's often said that friendships don't exist in pro wrestling. While there have been certain groups that were formed backstage mainly to look after one another, as time would progress, wrestlers haven't been as protective of their spots as they once were. The WWE stars have also become complacent being happy with where they are in the company. With that being said, the superstars travel for over 200 days in a year and see each other more than they do their families, and as such, it's only natural for them to build relationships with one another and depend on each other. Even the greatest of rivals on screen can become really good friends off camera. And with the wrestling business coming out of its shell, we've seen wrestlers hanging out in public and breaking kayfabe. My name is John, and in this video we will be taking a look at 10 WWE stars who you didn't know were close friends off camera. Jericho and the Big Show did not get off to the best of starts in WCW, with Jericho claiming that Show was a jerk during their time in the company. While the Big Show signed with the WWE in February of 99, Chris Jericho soon found himself in the same locker room with the Big Show, as both the superstars once again came face to face in the organization. However, Jericho attributed Show's negativity to the toxic environment in WCW and said that the world's largest athlete has changed considerably since he moved to the WWE. Jericho also revealed that he and the Big Show are now very good friends, and said that Big Show would be the first to admit that he was a jerk during his time in WCW. Jericho and the Big Show would later on team up in WWE and win the tag titles, proving once again that time heals all wounds. There is a lot of history between Kurt Angle and Brock Lesnar, and the two are close friends outside the wrestling realm. Nearly 15 years ago, Kurt and Lesnar were embroiled in a heated rivalry, which saw Lesnar beat Kurt Angle at WrestleMania for the WWE title. Both the stars have become good friends since, with Angle name-dropping Lesnar in the Big Show as two of his closest friends in the company. There is no doubt that once the cameras stop rolling, Lesnar and Angle are best buddies and reminisce about the old days. Alexa Bliss has quickly become one of the most popular singles competitors in the company, and it wasn't long ago that Little Miss Bliss was just considered to be a good valet, siding with Blake and Murphy on NXT. However, she's excelled on the main roster, winning both the SmackDown and Raw women's titles. Bliss is good friends with a lot of people backstage, however the same cannot be said about Lana. In the past, Lana had some unflattering things to say about the likes of Paige and Renee Young, which could point to the issues she had with the other women in the company. Saying that, Lana and Bliss are very close friends and are often seen hanging out when there are no cameras around. The ravishing Russian might not have many friends in the WWE, but she certainly has a lot of people she can count on, and that includes the five-time women's champion. It's kind of an open secret that Vince McMahon is a workaholic. The self-made billionaire is usually the first person to get to the arena for the tapings and the last person to leave the building. The fact that WWE is now the global leader in sports and entertainment is a testament to Vince McMahon's genius and his unrelenting quest for excellence. However, Vince is also known for his unorthodox methods, often challenging stars to fight him in bars, as recounted by Bret Hart. So Vince is good friends with only a handful of people, and that includes a peculiar name. R-Truth hasn't achieved the amount of success he would have wanted to in the WWE, but that hasn't stopped him from being good friends with his boss. Vince also reportedly likes R-Truth's sense of humor, and photos of the two have been snapped where they're sharing the occasional joke. As far as having friends in the right places is concerned, there could be no better friend for a WWE star than that of Vincent Kennedy McMahon. On TV, Braun Strowman isn't someone that other stars really want to get close to, as he's been seen tossing stars around, tipping over ambulances, and burying superstars under rubble, ensuring that they wouldn't forget their run-ins with the monster among men. However, outside the WWE ring, Strowman can be seen getting chummy with his fellow stars, working out and even going to shooting ranges, giving the fans a closer look at the man portraying the character. Strowman actually happens to be good friends with a former WWE champion, Jinder Mahal. Maybe it has something to do with their workout routines or the fact that they enjoy each other's company, but there was also a time when Jinder and Strowman rode together. 
While both the stars are often seen competing against each other in a ring, Mahal and Strowman like spending time with each other after the camera stop rolling. The paths of the Celtic Warrior and Drew McIntyre have crossed multiple times before they even came to WWE. And while Sheamus is a multiple time world champion, McIntyre's experience in WWE wasn't as positive as his. However, Drew went back to the indies, worked his way back to the top, and re-signed with the company. McIntyre has impressed everyone with his newfound attitude on Raw. Sheamus and Drew rose through the ranks in the UK together, and were good friends even before they signed with WWE. When McIntyre re-signed with WWE, Sheamus welcomed him back to the promotion, and both stars are often seen training in the gym together, pushing each other to their limits. When we talk about the most exciting stars in the WWE today, we definitely have to mention Daniel Bryan. Even though he had to sit on the sidelines for nearly three years, Bryan hasn't missed a step and is back to his best inside the wrestling ring. The former SmackDown Live GM is considered to be one of the most genuine people in the wrestling business and no one has anything bad to say about Bryan. Bryan is also good friends with former Cruiserweight Champion Bryan Kendrick. Daniel and Bryan have crossed paths on the indies before making their way to WWE and have been good friends ever since. During the Cruiserweight Classic, both Bryan and Kendrick shared a warm embrace backstage and got emotional while talking about their friendship and just how far they've come along since competing in bingo halls and high school gyms. Daniel Bryan often talks about the people he has worked with before coming to WWE and the bearded superstar has always spoken fondly about Bryan Kendrick and the role he played in his wrestling career. While the fans have seen Strowman getting cozy with Alexa Bliss during the Mixed Match Challenge, the Monster Among Men is also very close friends with Dana Brooke. Dana hasn't achieved much success in the company and is rarely seen competing in a WWE ring. However, Dana Brooke has found an ally in Braun Strowman, and both stars are often seen taking pictures with each other and posting them on their social media accounts. Before coming to WWE, Dana Brooke was into bodybuilding, and that might have been the commonality between the two that brought them together. Strowman being a freak athlete works out religiously, and who better to talk to about bodybuilding than Dana, who won the Female Image Award in 2017 during the Mr. Olympia competition. AJ Styles and Charlotte Flair have a lot of things in common. Both the stars are athletically gifted, have an affinity for championships, and are arguably the best performers in the company in their respective divisions. Perhaps it is their penchant for breaking the proverbial glass ceilings that has brought them closer to one another. The two stars are often seen traveling together and enjoying each other's company. Both the stars have also appeared on talk shows together and have shared photos of each other sleeping on flights. AJ Styles is currently married and is a devout husband and father. That does not mean Styles and Charlotte cannot enjoy each other's company, and they quite clearly enjoy spending time together. The Gold Standard re-signed with WWE, and it was believed that the company would push the superstar by putting a secondary title on him. However, Shelton Benjamin has gone nowhere in the promotion and is currently stuck in a rut trying to get out of a proverbial swamp which is the lower mid-card in WWE saying that very few fans are aware of the fact that Shelton is best friends with Brock Lesnar. In fact, Lesnar and Benjamin attended the same college and at one point Benjamin even coached Lesnar. When WWE signed both stars, they formed a tag team in WWE's developmental territory. And when they were called up to the main roster, Benjamin and Lesnar worked together multiple times, often butting heads. While Lesnar achieved superstardom in the WWE as a singles competitor, Benjamin became a tag team specialist before eventually receiving a push as a singles competitor. The two were so close that Lesnar made Shelton Benjamin the godfather of his two children. Brock is a private person and only interacts with a handful of superstars, but he shares a special bond with Shelton, given the history between the two. And these were 10 wrestlers you didn't know were close friends in real life. I hope you're all having an amazing day. Thank you so much for watching Wrestling Hub, and I'll see you later with more wrestling videos.